Greetings and salutations, gamers. This is Was85 with episode 64 of Let's Play Final Fantasy VII with DKS38. In the last episode, we had the Ford Icicle and found out that Eris' mom, Ivana, was there. And uh, they learned a little bit about our stuff. And anyway, we, we did a little bit of snowboarding and wound up in the Great Glacier. And we're going to go ahead and go try to get the Alexander material as quickly as we can. And we're going to show you the easiest way to get there. The easiest way to get there is just go this way. And, um, and then she leads us here. And then here, just take the north path. Battle time! And all that kind of stuff. We're going to go get the, the next summon material, which is in here. But you have to do it relatively quickly, because if you're not fast enough, you'll pass out and you'll miss the opportunity to get it. So, basically here, at the... Because we landed at, the, at that one area, it'll take up left, and it takes us to the next area. Then here, take the north area, which uh, we're gonna take the north area here, which will lead us to the next area we need to go to. Okay. So yeah, just continue heading north here. Yeah, and then uh. Here be a little bit of a uh, here. Let's keep walking through, and then here take a right. So just take a right here, and this will take us to area ten. And area ten, uh, I mean, you know, just and between every area, there's like a, just a straight path. So here through the straight path, and now this is area 10, and then here, just keep heading north. Might be another just straight path area, but once we get to where we go, I'll show you where we need to go. Geez, another straight path? Because there's two things you gotta do in order to get the Alexander material, like taking care of the first one of them right now. So we got to be quick at this. So, continue claw. Another continue claw. That's fine with me. Uh, one round of one round with all the party members to take care of these. Not too bad. Not too bad at all. Another serving continue. magic and stuff. Yeah. Another continue claw. All right. So take a few of these straight paths, and once we get to where we need to go, I'll tell you the next area we need to go to. Because this is a big, huge maze, and you can easily get lost. But if you just follow our our directions, you get to the Alexander material quickly. All right, so let's keep heading north here. That one's a little longer. All right. So now here, let's take that one, and then take the upper path to the left. Let's loop around, and then take the upper path to the left. And that should take us to the area eight, which is the first place thing you need to do. If you want to get the Alexander material, here you should see a hot spring. After going through a couple of paths. So. Once we get to the hot spring, we'll take it from there. Alright. Alright. See the hot spring to the left? Touch the hot spring. Go down there and touch the hot spring. Lettuce. Alright, you can head back in, head back down. It says, uh, touch the water. Oh, it says, touch the water, so. Back into it. Maybe go up around up there up top real quick. There's gotta be somewhere we can touch the water. Maybe on the other side, but to both sides. There's gotta be somewhere we can touch this water real quick. Come on, come on. There we go, there we go. This, this is the only place on potion to touch the water. Hmm, a hot spring. Oh, look there, sorry. <laughs> I tell him, not me. So anyway, now we need to head north, really quick. Now we got. To, now we touch the hot spring. We can go get Alexander. So here, let's head through a couple of uh, more of these straight areas. It'll lead us to area twelve. 
which is one of the next areas we need to go. Okay. So now once we want to get to area 12. It's going to be a little difficult to navigate because there is a, there's a bunch of wind. But once we get to the area, we will take care of it. Because we're almost there. All right. Leveled up. All right. There, our cloud leveled up. All right. So now, let's continue heading through here. It should lead us to an area with a bunch of winds. Just keep going. Just keep going. Uh, what? Uh, Snow, as far as you can see, better watch where we walk, where I walk. We'll place a landmark and start walking. All right. I go a bad spot? No. This is, the, this is area 12. This is where we need to go. Ultimately, we need to start heading to the right. The only way we can go is to the right if we want to start heading toward a... Just keep heading that way. So keep heading right, and we'll eventually reach another screen where we need to, where be, uh, where we need to go to get Alexander. So, uh, I don't know what those are. Cold snap, though. Thank cool. Missed though. Ha ha ha. Yuffie had it. Another cold snap. And 508. Holy hell. <laughs> okay. That didn't do as much as we thought it would. <laughs> but not there completely over. All right, Yuffie needs to heal herself. Mm -hmm. All right, so we just need to keep heading that direction, and it should eventually lead to another screen where we can get Alexander. Screw this. Oh, we're gonna cast Ball Almut. Screw this. Ball Almut. I guess every time we attack, it counter attacks with the uh, old snap. I don't know. <laughs> Mega Flare. But uh, once, we get, once we get Alexander, we can get out of this area. Even if we pass out, and it, it takes us to the next area anyway. That's the reason why we need to go ahead and try to get Alexander as much as we can, as fast as we can. Because if we get past, the, if we pass out, then we only get the opportunity to get him to later. Right. Or to get when we get, it, it, it didn't even kill one of them. One of them, yeah, but the other one's still alive. Wow, these things got late speed to it. I admit. Screw you. Wow. You think he's got some HP, I give him credit. There we go. <laughs> I definitely give it credit. The other thing's got some HP. Yeah. Probably about 3,000. And Barrett and Yuffie just leveled up. And we get no items. No, but I know who has the cure, cure material at least now. It's Yuffie. Alright, everybody deal. So let's keep heading. The way we're going. It should ultimately take us where we need to go, hopefully. Alright. This should take us to. No, just head right. It should take us to an area with a cave. I'm hoping. If everything works out well. If everything works out well, it should lead us to an area with a cave, which is where we need to go. Oh shit, everybody's got the damn fucking. Let's use them. Fuck it. Okay, never mind. Because we're still a ways away from the boss or whatever like that. Well, I mean, is this thing that we're going to be dealing with. Oh, yeah, yeah, there's no. Person. We might as well go ahead and use it. I mean, save it for her. Mm -hmm. This should hopefully lead to an area with a cave. After a few paths. Yeah, yes. The cave should be right there. Now, if we touch the hot spring, there should be a, a person in here that doesn't like snow. Right there. 
me like nothing like heat. Ew, you, I got a knot of nerve touch, trying to touch me with those same dirty hands that touched that filthy hot spring. I'll never forgive you. And battle time. We defeat this person, we get our summon material. It's the boss music, she's the one I wanted to that, say. This, this person's called the Snow Queen. She shouldn't be too hard, though. So, should just be a nice little quick battle. Uh -huh. Ice too. Mm -hmm. I mean, she'll hit it for a little. Wow. Okay, she hit it a little bit harder than I thought she would. But we should be able to get through this pretty easily, I'm hoping. Ice uh, she's two gonna, counter? She, she's gonna, that's her counter attack. Ice too. Like. Shit, if I'd known that, I'd use Mom Blow on the Barret. Yeah. Oh, that's it, though. <laughs> and she should drop our summon material. That's how you get to this place so we can get the summon material. We only get 500 experience points for it, but we do get an ice crystal. It's shit for guilt. But the ultimate thing is, is why this? And she drops the material. And Alexander material. That's how you get it, ladies uh -huh. and gentlemen. If you want to, we can equip Alexander with somebody to check Alexander out if you want to. What the heck is what this is thing? This shit? Back attack. The heck is this thing? Oh! What is it, Captain America throwing shields at everybody? Captain America. Can't wait for the second Captain America movie. Trying! Now if you even pa now if you pass out and all kinds of stuff doesn't matter, it's gonna take us to the next area anyway, so. <laughs> Trying killed it one hit. So now if you pass out it doesn't really matter, it's gonna take us to the next area anyway, so. Doesn't really matter. <laughs> wow, that one creature gave more experience than the Snow Queen. That's saying, bitch. Oh, uh, you want to equip uh, Alexander? Let's equip on somebody just to take a look. Who are we going to equip it on? Hmm. We need to have keep fire on there. Uh, Alexander's right there. All right. It's, it's, a, it's, a, it's a holy elemental. It's a holy elemental summon. Like most Alexanders are. Oh, is it, we're at 12 minutes. We should be able to get to, uh, hopefully, the guy eclipse here. Pretty soon. If we if, if we pass out, we pass out. How do we know when we pass? Okay. He'll, just, he'll, he'll just fall to the ground. Now we just need to head back up and start heading back to that one area we had to put all those landmarks down and hopefully get to the Gaia Cliffs. We were heading east. We need to start heading north. So from down. Come on, Barrett. Be the first. Oh my god, there's another Ice Queen. There's another Snow Queen. Are you kidding me? Now a common enemy? Judgment. Here we go, ladies and gentlemen. Here is Alexander. Wrong. <laughs> uh, what the fuck is this shit? He's a big, huge mech in a castle looking thing. As you can see. And he's holy. So, yeah. He's gonna do a lot of holy damage. <laughs> Damn! <laughs> Fascination. What is this? Uh, on Barrett. Oh no, Barrett's confused. And doesn't matter though. We killed the Ice Queen again. Was it the regular music or the boss music again? Regular music. Okay. <laughs> she still gives shit for experience. Shit for kill. Cheap bitch. Alright, so she, let's head this way. And let's, um, since we're heading east, we need to head north. So we need to start heading right again. I guess. We passed out, we passed out, it doesn't matter. <laughs> just like oh, that. Just like that. <laughs> Did it, just in time. <laughs> but now we wake up and we'll be at the, um, face of the guy eclipse for next area anyway, so, doesn't matter. You awake? <laughs> Hello, who are you? <laughs> you collapsed at the Great Glacier. It's a miracle you're alright. <laughs> Oops. <laughs> yeah, really. My name is Olzoff. I've been living here 20 years now. You've been living in here for... If you're planning to head north, you better listen to my story. Okay. Uh, what do you have to say, old man? Let's listen to your story. Why don't we go to the next room and sit down? Where's the next room? I guess head out here. Alright, so I guess it's gonna tell us a story. Okay, here we go. Oh, no. You ever hear about those, uh, challenge the crit? Those who challenge the cliff? 
Yeah. First time my friend Yasmin, Yasmin and I tried to climb the cliff about, about 30 years ago. But we, were, we weren't prepared for it. We didn't expect the temperature to be low. But on that cliff there was always fighting cold wind. The cold air lowers your body temperature. Yasmin was below me. He cut his own rope. I didn't even notice. Mm. Ever since then, I've settled here and continued to challenge Cliff with bright warning and shelter to my fellow climbers. If you're going to climb the cliff, there's two precautions you'll need to take. Okay. First, check your route. It's hard to find because of all the snow. Okay. Okay, button to confirm route. And press square button to repeatedly uh, push repeatedly to raise your body temperature. Second, once you get to the ledge, make sure you warm yourself up. Nice. Yeah, we understand. You must use a lot of energy getting up here. Better get some rest before you head out. Then we get the rest for free at least. And here's the thing about the Gaia Cliffs. You have to keep your body temperature warm if it gets even if you're further up and all kind of stuff, if you pass out on the Gaia Cliffs because the body temperature gets to down, we'll end up right here again. So uh, you should start the guy clips. We're going to try to call that a video. Okay, we're going to call that a video, guys. We come back. It's time to do the guy clips. This is going to be fun. But uh, we're going to do the guy clips and uh, getting closer and closer to our ultimate destination for now. So, all right. So y'all have a good day. We'll see y'all next time. Let's play Final Fantasy VII. This is DKS3 of the Crazy Gamer with the Lost 85. Signing out.